Hi friends, I got a haul. And then I wanted to let you guys know yesterday, this apple tart somehow escaped my haul. I uh, titled it New Fall Lip Glosses and then I was like, could have swore there was more than two and then uh, for, for fall. And then I found this apple tart one. I love this one, I have it on right now. It's kind of red, but it smells like a candied apple. It smells like a scent, like apple like a fruity apple and like a hint of cinnamon. It smells like those uh, candied apples you get in the store. They have like that red, like gooey kind of, uh, whatever it's called over it, topping, those little crunchy things. I think they make them with peanuts now, but it smells really good. I just wish it was a little stronger, strongly scented. And then I had gotten the almond glaze and then I'm gonna, uh, get more familiar with these scents. I've been real super busy. So the pumpkin brulee, these are both really good though. They're all three really good. I recommend all three of them. And then I kind of opened my bag because it was out in the heat and I knew I had this in here and I didn't want it to get smashed. Cause once it's hot outside and then you bring it in, if it's cold inside, then, uh, then it will s just stay to that form of whatever it got smashed to. So I, I bent it out real nicely and then let it cool off. So now it's in good shape. This is a beautiful bag. This is the one that came with the perfume set for you know, $68 for um, the perfume and a lotion in this bag. It's kind of big. I have big hands, so let's put it next to my face. That <gasps> house, but isn't it cute? It's like a really nice quality like leather. It matches this um, peony bombshell vanilla orchid. This They said, on the site that this is supposed to smell like bombshell, but it smells like cactus blossom to me. Unless it smells like the new bombshell, I think they may have changed the scent from what I hear. I did get the perfume and it's in here and it might be busted because it does kind of smell like the candle. So, oh, I wanted to show you the free, free pink gift too. It's like a tiny little bag, it's like a mesh bag. It's like, I don't know what you would use this for, like, uh, maybe the shower or something, or even just going to the beach or something. Cause it's real tiny and like, it's like mesh. So it has a, does it have a pocket? No, it doesn't, but it has a zipper. So these may end up in the clearance or at the semi-annual sale. Usually these bags that they have with the perfumes always end up there. And then this is the little bag that came with the leopard, the leopard tote thing. Um, it's cute. It's like a tannish pink color. I got this to use as a divider in my purse and it says pink. Um, so it's cute. I thought it was going to be more of like a leathery material, but it's like canvas, but it's still real nice. I like it. And then what else? We got this. I think this is the pink, um, pink hand sanitizer holder in, in blue. If you guys watch uh, How to Save at Victoria's Secret, I showed you how to get to the $68 perfume offer, go to the beauty section, because on the main offer page, it's only showing the $88 offer. So, and then also these are not showing up, so I showed you how to get to these. You go to the pink beauty and then you go down to, um, all the way down to hand sanitizers. And then you, put, you go to put one in your cart and then it will offer you to get one of these like at the bottom of the screen. So I just wanted this because I, I have the blue, um, the Icy Topaz mask to match. So I thought that would be cute to have the hand sanitizer and the mask to match. So that's real cute. I think that's $4.95. And then it's an empty bag. I hope this perfume's not busted. It smells busted and it's real hot, so I wouldn't be surprised. I've had it happen before, they shattered. That's wet. Oh my god, it shattered. It smells good though. It actually um, may smell a little different than the original bombshell. I have, I'll have to review it for you guys. But yeah, you can hear it, the glass broken and shattered from the heat. So, it smells really good. It may be a little different than the original bombshell, but I'll have to spray one on my arm and then like wipe it off the plastic of this one, I guess. It's funny. They'll replace it when I call them. 
they want me to bring it into the store, then I'll be like, sure. Not very smart. Usually they don't, though. Oh yeah, these are the hand sanitizers. Look, it's this is the Solar Blooms one. I wanted to review these for you guys. Got a bunch of reviews. Yeah, I was supposed to do a review last night, but I had to run some errands. And then I got yelled at by an older gentleman, but he wasn't really a gentleman. Because I parked in the handicap spot just for a second because I went to get my hair cut. And then I left my pink water bottle in there. So I can't walk good because of my foot. So my f usually I'll just wait for like a, f a front row parking or whatever. But as soon as I turned around, went back, my spot was gone. So I was like, I'll just park in the handicap for a second and run in to get my water bottle. And you could tell I was limping and everything. And this older gentleman, gentleman, was like, that's a handicapped spot. And I was like, I know. I was real nice. I was like, I know. My foot is messed up. And I just left my water bottle. It's only going to be a second. So that was funny. I always get yelled at. I'm not following rules. A bunch of Karens out there. That's real nice. This smells like, it says Solar Blooms Antibacterial Hand Spray with aloe. I was hoping not to like a lot of these items because I spent too much, but I think I got a 10 off of 50 on this. It's pretty good. It's not like the best smell ever, but it is good. It does smell like a sun kind of smell. Maybe a sun with a little bit of a cleaner scent, but maybe it's the alcohol. I don't know. It's all right. We'll see. I'll have to get familiar with it. I think I like the purple one better though. Oh, now it's stuck in my nostrils, and I have to uh, tell you what this smells like. Yeah, last time, on the time before last that I left the house, I went to Walmart, and I put, um, I waited a while to put my stuff on the cart. I didn't know if you're supposed to, like, wait until the per other person in front of you's stuff is completely off the belt. So I waited till it was, like, almost off the belt, just to, like, keep distance or whatever. So I was make made sure I was six feet from the older woman, uh, older ma'am. I don't know how to say it. <laughs> I don't know how to say it without with like to be politically correct and not get canceled. But anyways, so then she like she snapped at me and like yelled at me and I don't know. It makes me real nervous when they do that. I'm real nice. So I was like I don't I don't know what the rules are. But then like because when I left Great Clips yesterday. Oh, I was so nervous from being yelled at that I almost pulled out in front of somebody. That's why I don't like to leave the house. I like staying home. So that was sad. This is the Mandarin Peach hand sanitizer. That might be the best one. Yeah, I think this is the best one out of the three. And then the purple one and then the yellow one. Purple one, I forgot it was co coconut jasmine. And then the solar blooms, and then mandarin peach is the best. They're all pretty good though. That's cute. It's not as orange, huh? As it should be. It's kind of light, light pink. It looks light, lighter pink in person. What? I had to get out of my room. I <laughs> you don't like cat cuss. <laughs> it's going to say the B-A-L-L -L word. Cut. Uh, let's do it. Cut. He's freezing because he's... I'm burning up. No cutting. <laughs> like, oh, please don't say a bad word right now. I'm already being politically correct, so... Oh, the lids always pop off of these. This is the lotion. Bombshell Intense. I already know what this smells like, but I was just wondering if they changed the scent because they changed the bottle. It smells the same to me. This one might be a little more fruity and less warm and cherry-like. The cherry is not like a fruit cherry. It's like a deep, rich cherry. Oh, you have to take off this little thing. It's the second time it's popped off. It's too hot and the uh, FedEx people are like... I've had it. They're just throwing this stuff around. I don't blame them. Oh no, it's busted. I'm gonna have to replace that too because I only got this because it's a cute packaging because it matches the pink one too. Look at how cute this pink one is. The original bombshell. So 
That's so cute. Okay. Okay, let's see what else. And I got one more thing. And then they forgot my uh, 20 off 50 cards. So I have to call because this is the second order that they forgot my 20 off 50 cards. So there's that. And then I am going to do my reviews today. I used this uh, oat lotion out of the shower today. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Oh, this is a gift for my stepdaughter. She's spoiled like I am. Look at how cute to go with her pink bag. This is the pink python lock. It might still be online, actually. But this is cute to go with, like, the blush large toe I got for her because she's expecting. So I'm going to be a grandma. So that would be cute. Uh, it's not really like a di it's kind of like a diaper bag just for like a quick going to the store kind of bag if you, she doesn't if she doesn't want to carry her big diaper bag and then it matches her purse so I thought it would be cute that large blush tote I hauled before okay I'm gonna go sit in front of the AC and then I'll come back and do a review hope you guys are having a good day or night love Amber.